Hey guys, Rusty K here. Uh, happy day after Christmas to everybody. Wanted to bring you a little update on the projects I've been working on. Um, got two things I'm working on right now, as you guys are aware. Um, the Camaro, which I'm doing in the Outclad, and the Dodge, which I am doing in the uh, Don Yost method. And I'll explain a little bit what's going on. The products I was using on the Outclad, um, <laughs> the color didn't come out like I anticipated because I should have probably read this better. I was expecting to be a uh, uh, more of a, a bright yellow, and um, I forgot that I had bought that I had bought that I had bought the candy. Get that there, the golden yellow. You can see that, um, which is interesting. It came out really gold, which I, I do like, but I was expecting a, a more of a, a bright yellow. But let me show you. If you remember, I shot the the body. Um, I don't know if I actually showed the body after I painted him or not, but um, I don't think so. I painted these yesterday, but uh, I was doing the uh, Ferrari and the. Camaro in the color because I was going to test the Outclad Gloss Clear on the paint, which I had not done in the past. If you remember, let me pull this car out here. Shelby Mustang. This is the electric blue Outclad um, with no... Let me just get that in there show you. This is without any clear on it. So the Outclads come out nice without clear. But I wanted to... Um, try this with the clear to see how it comes out. So let me show you the body. Let me show you the Lamborghini first that I did, or the Ferrari I should say. This is the golden yellow enamel outclad candy paint, which um, I didn't put as many coats of the paint on this one, so the, the um, Camaro actually came out a little deeper. This is clear coated and the clear worked well. So I went ahead and cleared the Camaro. This is the Camaro with clear. I think it came out great. There's a little spot on the hood there that I uh, messed up on, but um, this has, I don't even know how many coats of clear, a lot. Um, interesting color to say the least. I wasn't expecting it to be this gold, but um, it uh, came out real well, so I'm going to work with it, and it's going to be a pretty cool car, I think, when it's said and done. There's a few little spots here on the, on the paint job, but this is, you know, I'm perfectly happy with this. Um, like I said, there's a part on the roof there that, and it came out a little hot on some of the parts. I don't know if you guys can see it or not, right there. See that little spot right there? It came out of the gun a little hot on that, so, um, uh, but that's fine. But this has the candy, or the candy yellow golden enamel and the outclad clear. I shoot this at about 25 PSI um, on the gun and uh, it came out really well. So I'm happy with, with that. Next, I worked on the Dodge doing the Don Yost method. Now, the Don Yost method, uh, I have his DVDs, and he uses the Metal Masters, or Model Masters uh, aluminum plate metalizer as his primer. So I took the body, sanded it all the way up to 12,000, um, and then I shot it with the metalizer, let that sit. Um, then what I did is I took the um, Purple Pearl uh, Model Masters Boyd paint, this is the purple pearl. Don't know if you can see the name there. I mixed this two to one, which is what Don Yost does in his videos. So I took two parts of this purple pearl and one part of a medium lacquer thinner, mixed it and shot it at about 28 to 30 psi. Um, this is still settling. I just shot this not too long ago, but this is doesn't have any clear on it yet. But this is. The enamel, I think it came out really well as, as well. This shot well. This has a lot of coats, a lot of thin coats. Um, I used the entire two bottles plus the thinner to, to shoot this. And I had the other parts as well, the hood and all that other stuff shot as well. But that's how this came out. I think that came out well. This is going to get, um, I may 
try to, after this dries in a couple days, get us a couple days of gas out, then I may try to actually wet sand this um, and then shoot to clear, the Model Master's clear, tester's clear, and see how it comes out. But this is the Purple Pearl Model Master's Boyd, and that came out... as well. So that's what I'm working on right now. Um, these are going to sit and, and gas out and, and dry out for a couple days before I start doing um, anything else with this. I may do start work on some of the interior and the chassis and things like that. The engine's already been worked on uh, for the Camaro. Um, I shot that in a Chevy engine red um, and I may go back and, and clear that. I'm not sure. But everything's going well. I hope everybody's Christmas was good and we will talk to you guys soon. Thanks. Don't mind my finger.